Hey folks, Joseph Rampoli here at AWE TV, and I'm hanging out with Eric Manchin from Intel. Eric, tell us all about what Intel's doing and tell us a little bit about what you're showing on the floor today. Well, so for 2014, the big thing that we got going on is what we're calling the, the Intel RealSense technology, right? Which is basically a webcam that will do everything a webcam used to do, but also has an IR sensor to grab 3D information, so you can actually do mapping in the real world, whether it's gesture recognition or facial recognition or object recognition. So some of the different demos that we have in the booth are basically demonstrating how these things happen. Like we have one where you have two different little figurines, and by depending on which one you pick, it'll pick a different character in a game so that you use that as your, almost like your controller. We have other ones where we can insert real, uh, real world objects into a virtual situation. That's what we're really trying to cultivate here, is talking about how the real sense technology can be used so that people can take physical objects, whether it's your face or gestures or whatever, and put them into the virtual world. Awesome. All right, you're gonna, we're going to get a, f a demo right now and yeah, see what you got? Show you. Yep. Awesome. Sounds cool. good. Thanks. We are here with John Putnam from Intel. John, show us your really cool demo here. Okay. Uh, this is actually what we're showing is the Intel RealSense SDK. Uh, it's currently called the Intel Perceptual Computing SDK, but it's going to be available in Q3 as the Intel RealSense SDK. It's part of Intel RealSense technology. And what this is is a clip-on developer camera but integrated cameras will be shipping on Intel systems for major OEMs later this year. Uh, the SDK allows you to go beyond the mouse and keyboard for control of a PC. It supports voice, gesture, uh, poses, facial tracking. And so what we're showing here in this demo is 2D, 3D object recognition and tracking. And uh, it's able to tell the difference between Jeffrey who uh, you could probably also saw over there in another demo called Jeffrey's Funky Farm, or the monkey. Here's the monkey. And you can see down here what the camera is seeing. It's actually seeing the monkey. And then the monkey goes around and eats bananas. I, the monkey actually works better in this demo, I think, because it likes bananas more than Jeffrey does. And you can see I'm up to 13,105 bananas that it's eating. So, you know, it's a kind of a neat technology demo that we're doing here.